Hi, my name is Stephen McGee and I'm the author of Health Forensics. And we're here to take a little look into this experiment. As you can see, we've got a plant on the left that has a battery. And we have a plant on the right that has a battery. And if we take a closer look, we can see that on this plant we have the negative going to the stem structure and we have the positive going to the pot. And we have the opposite over here, so we have the negative going to the pot and we have the positive going to the stem structure. Now, what's interesting about this experiment is the pot itself. So, you can clearly see that the pot on the left is very different to the pot on the right. So, let's have a little look at what's going on. So, if we look at this, this is rust. So this pot has rusted, and you can see it's all rusty on the bottom, and it's the same all the way around. So wherever the pot has been wet, it's been it's rusted. Whereas over here, we have a different effect taking place. So it looks like it's covered in minerals. This pot. So flip it out. You see, there's a little bit of rust down there by the hole, but. It really is quite a different part, and I believe it's due to the polarity of the battery. So, this polarity where you have the pot kept positive relative to the stem structure of the plant, which is negative, causes the pot to get this coating on it, whereas this polarity over here, which is negative on the pot and positive on the plant, causes the, the pot to corrode. Uh, I found that quite fascinating and it appears to be related to galvanic corrosion, which is extensively documented in physics. I hope you enjoyed the presentation and I wish you the very best of health. Thank you.